one of the components of Ford Sierra's success was a wide range of modifications, including three- and five-door hatchbacks, four-door sedan, and five-door station wagon. This allowed the company to meet the various needs of customers. When buying a used Sierra, it is first of all recommended to pay attention to the condition of the wheel arches of the rear fenders, this is their main weak point, the most susceptible to corrosion. It is also worth considering that for cars of early years of production, rubber seals for doors, trunk lids, and taillights are of low quality. Salon Sierra, one of the most spacious in its class. Inside, five people can comfortably accommodate, and if necessary, even four large passengers can fit on the gallery. The angular dashboard today looks a bit old-fashioned. Torpedo Sierra does not creak, unlike domestic cars. Engine. Ford Sierra was aggregated with 13 petrol engines and two diesel engines. Given the venerable age of the model, the resource of most power units is already running out, so when buying a car, ask if the former owner did a major overhaul or if this expensive procedure will fall on your shoulders. Of the gasoline engines, we can recommend 2.0 liter, the golden mean between good dynamics and acceptable fuel consumption. Units with a volume of 1.6, 1 1.8 and 2.0 liters, 90 horsepower, are not powerful enough, and charged, turbocharged engines of 2.0 liters, 204 horsepower, and 2.0 liters, 220 horsepower, are voracious and expensive to maintain. As for diesel engines, we advise you to opt for a less powerful and more reliable 2.3 liter unit, since the 1.8 liter turbo diesel has a not entirely successful design of the timing belt drive guard which causes dirt and moisture to get on the rollers, contributing to their premature failure. In carburetor versions, the cold start membrane often breaks, and in injection versions, the airflow meter fails. Transmission. Cars of the first years of production were equipped with four-speed manual gearboxes and three-speed automatic ones. Later, a five-speed mechanics and a four-speed automatic were installed. Mechanical gearboxes are more reliable, although they still show leaks in the shank seals and the speedometer drive. On older machines, the flexible coupling of the drive shaft fails. Most Sierras are equipped with classic rear-wheel drive, but all-wheel drive versions of the XR4x4 are very rare here. It is advisable to refuse to buy all-wheel drive vehicles, since in the case of a transmission repair, not only serious financial costs are possible, but also problems with finding the right spare parts. Suspension Sierra Independent Suspension is energy-intensive and long travel. When choosing a car, pay attention to the rear suspension. If the wheels are uneven, then due to the untimely replacement of silent blocks, more than 100,000 kilometers, the diagonal levers are bent. Ball bearings nourish 20 to 30,000 kilometers, and they change only complete with the front lever. Steering. Power rack and pinion steering, which is on most modifications, is somewhat imposing, although handling is normal for a calm driving style. Brake system. Most cars were equipped with front disc brakes and rear drum brakes. Sierras equipped with ABS and rear disc brakes are much rarer. In general, the braking system does not have any major drawbacks. Sierra can be recommended to family people who, after selling a domestic car, ventured into buying an inexpensive and unpretentious used foreign car.